girls and of course some very very excited girls who just walked past but we've kept some back to, to speak to you guys and we're going to be speaking to them very very shortly but before that a head teacher of course the happiest probably of mm. them all mrs miles how are you this morning really happy delighted for the girls all of them are going to be able to go on to the courses or the apprenticeships or the jobs that they're choosing and that's the most important thing that this is the stepping stone to the next uh, the next part of their educational journey so we're delighted for them we're delighted for the parents we're delighted for the community most definitely and also this, this year similar to last year has been a very difficult year how have you uh, kind of seen the girls kind of prosper and come through and obviously on results day when it all kind of comes together how has that journey been for the last year I think really, I think all head teachers would say this, I think we really need to pay tribute to our students because I think this year has been probably more difficult than last year in terms of the assessment process uh, for them and they have really risen to the challenge. They've shown enormous resilience, enormous commitment and they've been rewarded uh, for that. So I think I'd like to pay tribute to the girls but also to the parents, the community, members of staff and children and learning trust that have supported them right the way through. Most definitely, and I was just speaking to my colleague on the way here, and all the children and learning trust, in fact, all the schools in Newton, seem to be getting better year on year, and I think it's absolutely amazing for the community. And I think, obviously, you, you've thanked the, uh, the, the students and the parents, but I think it's a big, big thank you from myself to yourself, because obviously it's you and your team, and obviously uh, the, the team is as good as, as its leadership, and I think you guys are doing an amazing job. So thank you so much for, for the hard work that you do. Thank you so much, and thank you for showing such an interest in our school and our girls. Perfect. Thank you so much. That was, of course, the head teacher. Now we're going to be speaking to some students uh, who will be, of course, sharing their results. Uh, and hopefully we'll be uh, speaking to uh, them very shortly. Listeners, you are listening to Inspire on 105.1 FM. It is the live GCSE uh, results broadcast. And we've got the first student here. Uh, what's your name? Um, I'm Hardy. Hardy. And uh, what, what, how did you do today? I'm good. What, what, would you like to share any results with us? Six and nine, and you're saying them so casually, <laughs> like they're easy to get. And I know from speaking to uh, the students over the last few years since the number grading system came in, a nine is obviously not impossible because you guys are getting them regularly. It's very, very difficult. How, how do you feel this morning seeing all those nines on the, on the marks? Nervous, excited, you know. I didn't know what to say to you. Excellent. And what do you plan to do now? You plan to go to college? Yes, six form, do sciences and psychology. Excellent, mashallah. That's absolutely amazing. Well done. Enjoy today. You definitely deserve it. Thank you so much. Thank you. Okay, that was, of course, a, a very, very excited student there, mashallah. And nines, and listeners, nines are very, very, very difficult, I must say. And these guys are churning them out like anything. We've got another student to speak to us. Salaam alaikum, what's your name? Fatima. Fatima. And Fatima, how did you do today? Um, I think I did great. Would you like to share some results with us? Sure. Um, I got six nines and four eights. Six nines and four eights. That isn't all right, Fatima. That is absolutely amazing. You absolutely smashed it. Well done. And what do you plan to do now? Um, in sixth form, I plan to find my courses to take medicine in future. Medicine. Excellent. That is an excellent uh, career path you've got set out there, and I'm sure you'll do great. Well done. Enjoy the rest of the day. You definitely deserve it. Thank you. Thank you. Absolutely amazing. Listen, that was Fatima there. Nines, six nines and four eights. Absolutely amazing. And we've got one last student we'll be speaking to here before we go over the Tony High School for Boys. Uh, Sanka, what's your name? Uh, Nimra. Nimra. And Nimra, how did you do this morning? I did very good, I think. <laughs> and what were your results? I got six nines, three eights and one distinction star. That is absolutely amazing. And again, I keep hearing nines, nines, nines. Would you like to explain to the listeners what a nine actually means? So a nine's um, the upper end of an A star, but it's something referred to as an A star star, so it's like a new grade. It's like a double A star, so for listeners, for those of you who, like myself, may have done the GCSEs 15, maybe 20 years ago, and we would, we would be very, very fortunate to get an A, these guys are not getting A stars, they're getting what we would call a double A star, and they're getting them in so many subjects, which is absolutely amazing. And what do you plan to do with these results now? Um, I plan to do biology, chemistry, and maths, um, at Hawkley Human Sick, and then I'm thinking of um, going into dentistry and medicine in the future. That is absolutely amazing. I'm sure you'll do amazing. Thank you so much for speaking to us and enjoy the rest of your day. Thank you. Absolutely amazing results here as expected.